Hi guys, how are you? How's everyone feeling tonight? So y'all, I had a very long day. And wait until y'all see what I was doing today. It, oh, oh, oh. Hey, booby. Wait until y'all see what I had to do today, child. It was so much fun. Wait, first of all, y'all, why is Friday night and y'all in the house? What, what what's good? Y'all not y'all not hanging out? Hi, Poppy. I see. So let me ask y'all. Let me ask y'all something. Do y'all go out? Like, what is the going out scene like right now? Cause you know the queen got to pop out right now. You know what I'm saying? The queen about to be popping out. You know what I'm saying? The queen about to be outside every day. Oh, so you can like people's comments on live now. Get out of here. They started shooting where? Who was shooting? So, yes, blick, blick. So, so, yo, so wait a minute. Are y'all going outside? Hi, Trisha. Thank you, Papia. Who was shooting and where? Why somebody was shooting? Though nobody better not be shooting at my babies. Hi, Cuban. Hi, Bria. How are y'all? Um. Yes, Jade, I am coming outside. I'm coming outside because I need me a new girlfriend anyway. <laughs> um. Hi, boo boo. Hi, y'all. So, y'all, it's a Friday night, and what y'all doing? And 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 go into. You are, you're choreographing um, a dance to Blick Blick? <gasps> Let me see it, girl, because you know I'm going to kill it because my dance moves got so crazy. Ooh, yes. Um, <laughs> listen, okay, so everybody go and tell Koi Lorraine to come. Tell Koi Lorraine to come and talk to me. I'm over here. I'm chilling. Me and Fendi is here. We putting some things together. We about to bring y'all back to come up DVD. You know what I'm saying? Right, Fendi? 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 Oh, you gonna let me stand it? Oh, <laughs> I see you. <laughs> How you gonna log in and be here at the same time? <laughs> Fendi, what you doing? Look, me and Fendi about to do Hi, Russ Thank you, Russ R Russ, I know I gotta turn your verse in Don't think I lied, okay And one thing about Russ He gonna just always have one of them months um, Wait, Fendi Can you can you tell them that you made me the the new owner of, Fendi, of the Come Up DVD? The Come Up DVD is now back um, Onika Mirage is the owner and, Ooh, um, you can't. You gotta say the my last name because oh you know. Onika Petty is the owner. <laughs> and, um, it's, a new, it's a new regime, man. I'm, I'm out of but the Come Up DVD is back. Mm -hmm. He, girl is he went bankrupt, and I I yeah. bought him out. I just yeah. made him tonight. I just made yeah. him a billionaire. Yeah. He don't even know. Um, I threw of like two hundred dollars, two hundred million at him, and then <laughs> I mean, everybody hashtag the Come Up DVD. It's not going to trend. It's not like yeah. it could trend going to come on Instagram. What is saying Twitter? Make, you just bought it so I want to make sure everybody know that you, you're the new owner. Oh, yes. Well, yes. I just bought the Come Up DVD from Fendi. Yep. And yeah, we're back in business. Yeah, we're back in business. Get in the camera. How are they going to see? Back in business. And um, when is your first episode coming on? The Come Up DVD Volume 1, right? Volume 1. When are you dropping? Um, 
Wait, we gonna talk about that. Pull up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. <laughs> Give it up too much. I'm giving up too much. I'm yeah, giving up. Let me spray my lights all the time. Stay tuned. Talk DVD. Bio one next week. Yeah. Ooh, you ain't heard it from me. You ain't heard it from me. You ain't heard it from me. <laughs> so, but y'all. But you know what though? This what? Said that. Huh? Because everybody keeps saying. We want the old Nikki, we want the old Nikki, we want the old Nikki, we want come up to Nikki, we want. Say they say that all the time. Oh, okay. You had to say that right now? I, you was like, you that so now. Along with me, but no, now we, you, okay. Well, I mean, what? You're not, you're not, and then all about you. All right, but you ain't supposed to say, you supposed to, you were supposed to back me. And I said, they didn't well, say that. What the hell are they about to You're right. You oh, know okay. you're right. You're right. My bad. But listen, stay tuned. Hi, so you walked all the way over here to say it. Yeah, I said it's I so stupid. So, no, t Fendi, tell them, let them know what my role is. Oh. You oh. understand, cheese? I'm gonna have to work. No, Fendi. Yes. Tell Pop my puss to Blick, Blick, Blick. Fendi. Tell yes. tell tell them what my new job entails, child. Oh hi, Miss Jasmine Booby, how you doing? Oh yes. So I'm gonna be in the company for me. Yes. She's in she she's her new title is uh well first of all, she's she's the owner, so what do we say? Well right. outside of that. But this is what she promised me. Yes. That she was gonna give you guys a lot of fun. Oh, she gonna give me a lot of fun. She gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you a lot of fun. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give you but Fendi, basically, basically, what we're about to do, you know, for the culture, for the community, yeah. is take it back to the talent. Take yeah. it, not saying that, you know, there's not talent out, yeah. out here now, but just focusing on talent, new up and coming talent, especially, you know what I'm saying, yeah. from the inner cities, people that's more. Well, Nikki's about to sign a lot of new talent yeah. off this new come up. This new, new come up DVD thing is about bringing in new talent as well as showcasing her greatness. So. Okay. Yeah. So. Same. So basically, so Fendi, what type of, tell them, tell them, you know, from your perspective, because I am also, you know, with my own record label, I did give, yes. I did give Fendi a job, you know. Yes. We won't, we won't speak on that right now yeah. in a second. I but, got hired, yo. Yeah, but so Fendi, tell me what type of things are you, you know, what, Qualities in an art in an artist are you looking for? Uh, for first of all, more than anything, I'm looking for a superstar. Mm -hmm. I, the music is great, you know. People, a lot of people can rap, but are you a superstar? Is what I want to know. And and that, and that entails a lot of things here. Now, it ain't all. It's, it's music, music is definitely a big part in this. But are you really a superstar? Or are you just a rapper? Mm. And we're bringing, we, we, we looking for superstars, we're looking for rappers. Okay. Or singers, we're looking for superstars. All right, what is, 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 is popping their pussies a part of that? Uh, it could be, it oh, could be. Uh, but, oh, okay, so. It could be, so, it could be. But yeah, it, no, that's not talent though. Oh. Anybody can do that. Sure enough can. We're looking for starship, so if you ain't got the starship, it's not what we're looking for, but Nikki is definitely the head honcho in charge, and she's definitely looking for something that might catch her eye. What do you What do you think? What do you What do you like? You guys, you know what I want to do? What I haven't seen done in a while. So obviously, I am signing right now male rappers. I'm signing female rappers. I'm signing male singers. I'm signing female singers, right? But you know what I want to do? I want to do a group. And what kind of group? and what I want to do within that group is. I wanna, I wanna have a girl group. 
right? But not all singing, not all rapping. One, but, two but, singers, one rapper, or one rapper? Two, I one. think four girls. Four girls. Okay. Four girls, and I got to figure, ain't nobody say making a band, the menage rooms, or your ass down shit. I just said, uh, you know, because... You know, Fendi, that's just... I'm just celebrating my new job over here. I'll get back to you guys in a minute. You say this shit. Um, okay, I'm sorry. So where is Quay? Let me see if I can see it. Because we've been up all day. I can't see Quay. Y'all, yeah, it's a request to join. But I don't see it. Earth to Koi. Where are you? Earth to Koi. Now, watch all these labels start going out, assuming that they know what I'm looking for, trying to beat me to it, bitch. Um, oh, hi, Koi. I see you, baby. Hi, Quay. Hi. How let me get a filter. Hold on, let me grab a little filter. We got a little... You don't need no filter. Oh. You don't need a filter, girl. You want me to take it off? Yes. Let me take it off and embrace this. Is it Ooh. off? Ooh. Hold on, wait, it ain't off. I don't need a filter. I got my makeup. Koi, Koi, you are, you're not a lesbian, right, Koi? No, no, no. I like dick. Are you bisexual? No, I ain't pussy before, though, but I mean. You did? Yeah, it just wasn't for me. <laughs> After you was up in it, that's when you realized? After, yeah, after I was in it, that's when I realized that. I was like, listen, this is not for me. This is not my type of thing. Uh, you know what it is, Nikki? I, li I like a man's touch. Like, I like aggression, and I'm I'm just, like, you know, I don't... Yeah, I like aggression. Mm -hmm. So, a girl can't really give me that aggression, you know what I'm saying? And Some I'm, girls are aggressive. Like, look at uh, young... MA. Like, is that aggressive enough? I feel like that's my, like, that would be my homie. Like, I couldn't, you know what I'm saying? Like, she's cute, but it's, it's, I, it, like, yeah, like, nah, like, she's, I'd rather just date a boy, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just cause, just, you know, I was raised by boys and I, like, I'm the only girl, so, you know, my, my shit looks a little, like, I guess, lesbian or tomboy or you know dykish or whatever they want to call it but mm -hmm. but i don't know i always say like because all my friends is gay i have a gay best friend two of them and um and i asked them i say i asked them i'd be like yo maybe one day like i'll meet a girl in the future and like she'll change my mind like mm -hmm. i'm not you know what i'm saying like maybe. oh so you're not opposed to it right I'm now just you're not just I'm not into it. Like, it don't turn me on right now. But maybe, maybe, just maybe. I don't know. Like, you know? So, you know I had my stage, right? <laughs> yeah, you, 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 like, do you still like girls? Do you like girls? <sighs> Why is this lady named Hazel Baby on the, on our live talking about y'all both fine? See, yeah, see, y'all crazy. Y'all <laughs> Um, no, but that's the whole other, that, she gotta be on Queen Radio, chat. I got lots of questions for that. Hey, girl. No. Hey, Hazel. So, my thing is, yes, yeah, so I had a boo when I was in high school, high school. And she was so, 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 so cute. But anyway, that's not, it's not about me. It's about you and Blick Flick. Um, now, first of all, <laughs> we just go and jump in. Okay, so what, um, 
how long did it take you to come up to that come up first of all i have to stop i always have to give a very warm shout out to champagne poppy oh yeah because, you know because champagne poppy is our hero you know like oh i told you koi that he liked the song before it came out right yeah 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 yeah, yeah i got some some knock some knock this i was talking shit on my story about some knock this like oh lord let me show you how to source these real quick this shit's just it about what the Noctas, the Nocta shoe. Where the Noctas? You ain't see the not the Drakes? Come on, no. the Noctas. You ain't see the Noctas? No, I didn't see the Noctas. Show, show me the Noctas. Show me the Noctas. I'm about to show you the Noctas. Um, but Drake, what are you doing? Are you in Turks? Drake can get the cat. Make sure y'all let Champagne Poppy know. Can't nobody rock these Noctas. You know what I'm saying? Like, hold on. Oh, wait. Did he send you these? Those? Yes. I wore them today. I'm, I went, I did a Spotify for No Cap for London today. <laughs> all right, and I wore, I wore these. I've been wearing these all day. So you, said Drake, so you said Drake sent you that? Yep. Sends me every, every collection. OVO. They already know because Nikki, you know I get I'm the drip god, like, and he knows what he's doing when he's sending that drip because I put it on for real, you know. Oh, I'm glad you said that because somebody about to get cussed out. <laughs> Yo, what's good? She has a yeah. poppy send Nikki her shoes. Yeah, and then the last time he was over here, he said that he had a a, a gift for me. He think I forgot. He had a whole gift for me. And he didn't never give it to me, and he thought I forgot. So he's gonna have to come bring that gift. You are gonna have to give her the Nocta. She needs now, the now. jacket. She need the OVO um, NBA collection. Like send her everything right now. No, you notice what he been always doing to me, right? He always be trying to just like style on me, but it's all good. You understand what I'm saying? But Nikki, you gotta wear it though. If he sent it to you, I would wear it. I would. Remember when Little Wayne sent me truck fit? I wore it. Okay, I I shows love to my brothers, to my boobs. Right now, now he talking about he could ship it. The, it, it was like five months ago, and he was like, "Oh, I left it in the trunk. I'll, I'll, I'll bring it back." He ain't never come back. Oh my god! Like that boy. Anyway, so so coy. Um, now, what is your process like? How long How long did it take you to come up with the hook? Did you do the hook first, or did you just start rapping at the top of the of the ver of the beat, and then just got, went into the hook? Just did the hook first. And then the verse, I, I don't know. It depends. Like, when I'm in the studio, like, whatever vibe, I'll get some little drink. You know what I'm saying? Little vibes. I'll be with my peoples because my circle is real small. And um, I'll vibe. Sometimes I'll be rapping. And I don't know, like, if you know what I mean. But, like, you know what I mean. Listen, right? Tell me. So, listen. If, if When I'm rapping, sometimes I'll start rapping. And then it'll sound like a verse is first. And then along the way, the hook will come into it. You feel me? And then, like... At the end with the engineer, we might sit down and like drag the hook to the front or mm. that type of vibe. So yeah. Okay, okay. Um, I didn't. I remember when they told me that they were sending me something, something of yours. I didn't expect to love it. Um, like on that vibe. Like I thought I was gonna. I thought it was because I don't know if you know this. No more parties is like one of my favorite freaking songs like like no for real okay and when i had came off of my hiatus and you had tweeted one day oh tell nikki to do a, a remix to this and everybody was like no why, you know you got remixes so I, did, I didn't know what was what was going on but when i listened to it i went back and told everybody i said well, one that was so crazy i would have got on this song because i loved that song so i didn't expect to you know when when they told me they had a record from you I definitely didn't think it was going to be the blick blick vibe, and so I just didn't expect to like love it like that, right. you know. Because I spoke to, I was tell, I told my fans at that time I was getting a lot of songs, and I was just, you know, I'm just getting back into the, you know, anyway, like just the creating and writing a lot, 
And so, um, so it's, it's very rare that something inspires me enough to even want me to just be happy enough to just be in that free spirit and fight, you know? Right, right. Um, did, you. That's so fire. I appreciate did you, that. Did you expect me to rock with it? Did you, like, was it one of those ones when you did it and you was like, oh, no, anybody that don't, they'll be crazy if, if they don't like this. Like, what, 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 what you, yeah. I thought, I, like, I had did a second verse and I was like, the song's fire, right? But, like, I ain't never, ever in my mind, because, you know, I DM do, I'm be honest, I didn't hit you in your DMs, but you ain't never open it. You ain't leaving me on Reddit, nothing. You just ain't open it. I know you probably flooded, but I DM'd you. And I'm just like, damn, like, I have no way to get in contact with when her. When did you DM me? Probably back in, like, 2017, 18. So many people have DM'd me from years ago, but my my DMs, if, a per, if I don't follow the person, I don't get their DMs. Yeah, it I goes in another request. Like, it'd it be in a whole nother, and then now they got these a whole nother request situation where it ain't even worth going through the DMs, I'm gonna be honest. Right, because then it, there was something told me, someone told me one time, oh, look and see your request, but it's like thousands. How do people go through that? Like thousands to see just somebody just requesting to send you a message. Yo, so, I'm glad you ain't even see it, because the fact that what makes me feel more even good is the fact that you actually fuck with me and my music. Like, you, you heard my music, and you're like, yo, I fuck with her. So... Like that means more, you know. Like, of course, I want. I reached out and I wanted it, but it's different when you know you someone really sees your talent. When you, especially when you put, outside all the bullshit, you know. It feels better when your ta your work catches everyone's attention. You know, you know, you know what I'm saying. Like that's how. Let me tell you something. And Fendi's Fendi, Fendi, come here for a second. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're here. This is some real shit. It's funny, right? And this is the truth. It's a rapper, right? And I won't say no names because that's not what it's about. When I first started off, I was putting out my mixtape. We, you know, Fendi had uh, relationships with people or whatever, so he would ask them to do a verse for me or whatever. There was this one rapper that said, you know what? I'm not going to give Shorty a verse, but I'm going to give her a drop right now. You know what I'm saying? And I was so thankful and appreciative. And Fendi's here now. If he's lying. He'll tell you, I never used to want to ask people for a verse. I used to be like, you know what? I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna get them back. I'm gonna get them when, when, when I, when I really show, show who, who I am and really, you know, show my skills and da da da. And then I'm gonna get it. You know, be, I always wanted it to be from just like I just wanted it to be organic. Like that artist really fuck with me and da da da. I never wanted him to go and ask anybody to do a song with me or like, you know, what I'm saying or them should just do a song. I don't anyway, though. No, but but remember how I used to be like that. It. I used to, like, I never asked for any of the females to do a song with me or whatever. I just was, like, show them love. You, you feel me? Like, never even, I never wanted one in the beginning, and I never expected one. So I feel what you're saying. Like, yo, it's iller. It's way Ill, iller when a person just hear you and see you grinding and see your movement. You understand? Yeah. Nah. Or, or they I, just, I, like. It's true. Yo, and, and it was at one point, like, on my come up, I ain't. You know, I didn't, I didn't, I felt like being in the club, you know, I felt like if I wasn't booked or if I wasn't, you know, everybody got this jewelry and all this other stuff. And I felt like I had to work hard, you know what I'm saying? To stand next to folks. Like it is a competition. It's a, it's hip hop is a competition, right? And the music industry is a competition. So when you walk in there, you want to feel just as good. And I felt like I just have to work 10 times harder. And, you know, even through the hate, nigga, I grinded through that shit still to this day, just grinding. And now look like we, Number one on iTunes, we over a million views. Can you girls stop? Can, like, can you girls? Can you girls stop talking about hate? Y'all have y'all have never. Uh, listen, I promise you, I mean, y'all have never experienced hate like the way this this guy right here, me, has experienced it. So don't wish for it. I'm telling you, what y'all have experienced is nothing. Y'all have just experienced some of the the growing pains of artistry and like right. uh, of of social media, like. Y'all be thinking y'all have experienced hate, and trust me, you ain't experienced it yet. Right. Okay. A lot of y'all have gotten really not coddled, but y'all have been pe people have been uh, nice. People have been like gentle with y'all. I think you know, and that's cool because who gives a shit? You know, um, when I when I felt that you were beating up on yourself, I spoke up for you because I just wanted you to be like, girl. This too shall pass. And I had no intention of doing a song. I didn't know we would end up doing a, a song. 
But I'm just saying, can people stop acting like y'all got it hard? Y'all don't know what the fuck it feel like to really have it hard in this industry, okay? No, look, but Nikki, look, I feel like, so look, when I say y'all, I feel like, honestly, I don't even want to be in the y'all category. And I say this with the most up respect. I have uh, of the most up respect for the female rappers, but in, in singers, female artists in general, because I don't really like to, like, I, I was watching on live, I don't want to say just female rappers, just female artists, right? I feel like I'm the type of, I'm just different. And I, I could really put myself in a different category than any other female when it comes to, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like that's why you kind of gravitated towards me, you know, because look how, like, opposites attract, you know, you the Barbie and I'm the fucking, you know, and we standing next to each other in the video. You see how great it looks? Like, I feel like, you know, so. I do feel like, I, I, I do feel like I'm attracted to, to people that maybe, you know, don't feel more like myself in, in that I feel like I'm discovering something new, you know, like something unique. I guess that's like everybody wants to feel like they're discovering something special and something unique and something that they haven't been seeing, seeing a lot. But at the same time, no matter what, if a bitch got bars, it's going to always catch my attention. You know what I'm saying? So even if the person, it doesn't matter how a person looks. If I, you know, talent is talent. Right. And there's been a lot of talent um, jumping out lately from some different people, you know what I'm saying? But I do think you're, you're, you're right. Like, um, we are very, very opposite in a lot of ways. But, right. but I just loved a lot. Like, I just love a lot of your choices that you made on, especially on Blick Blick. I was like, and then at the end of the verse, because I'm like, okay, the first four bars, everybody gives a good for first four. A little melodic. Okay, she's been hot. She has a nice, she has a nice tone. But, but then when you got, when you got to the, well, hold on, hold on, hold on. all these diamonds different color, color, color. I said, okay, uh, yep. So, you know, because then I was like, now this is my kind of bitch right here, you know, because kept on, kept on elevating it, you know what I'm saying? Um, and getting sassy and adding some flows and some flavors. Right, um, and that's and, and and you wanna not to cut you off, but listen, right? This is why I feel about female rap because I love female rap, but this is why you're you're you because the way you do it and this is just this is my opinion like you're you're so authentic and it's like you, you know you got rap right i don't know how to explain this but you got people who like freestyle and do freestyling shows right and shit like that and then you got people who are on radio doing type of it's different type of things right you can actually rap on anything and you know how to articulate it it's like science to you and it still be rap you know what i'm saying and i gotta give that to you because that is something that to where it just don't sound like all right like yeah it's just about bars too but i feel like it's about bars it's about cadence it's about delivery it's about you know melodies it's about switch up you know and and absolutely that's what makes a like a top you know and i feel like <laughs> Yes, thank you, thank you. Basically, what what basically what she's saying is, stop. You know, we don't want boring. We want you know the the listener, the listener right now, right now in the world, they can go and hear their share of eighty five thousand billion quadrillion songs if they want to at the at the touch of their fingertips, right? Right. So so when they listen to you, they want to feel like. Oh, she's keeping me interested. She's not just gonna say the whole same flow for the same, but the dumb, like, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and like, you know, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and and also, and also, and I'm just being honest, but somebody told me because I did my little check because I, I asked someone that I knew would have told me the truth, and they were like, oh no, she actually writes her her own music. And I was like, no, she don't. And no, uh, and 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 they were like, nah, absolutely, 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 without a shadow of doubt. So I was like, yeah, okay, sign me up, you know, because that's dope. I want girls to, to be proud of their fucking brain yeah. and know that, guess what? And you know what? Everything doesn't have to be perfect. Everything don't gotta be bar, bar, bar. But you know, um, I like your point of view, and that's and women just need to know that. Guess what? We want to hear your point of view, period. Right. Like, and um, you know, Drake joined us, and 
one thing about him, like you were saying, he's able to do those different things like singing and not make it sound like you're listening to um, an, an R&B song per se. Cause the, you know, he's just always been able to change, change everything up that you don't know the choice he's gonna make. So it keeps you interested. Like where yeah. are you about to go with this, you know? Right. Whether it's two two random singing lines in the middle of a, in the middle of a verse or like you know, right? It, it just I I love I like that and so I respect it and I appreciate it. So I'm not gonna um I'm not gonna say too much because I know we gonna um we gonna do a bigger conversation soon. I don't want to give it too much away, but I just wanted to tell you that I'm proud of you. And and thank you. Thank you for thinking of me as well. I appreciate you. And keep on doing your thing. And let me just say this, okay? I, I for the record, I didn't want, if, if it was up to me, I wouldn't, I would have told Koi not to wear wigs and wigs in the video. But that ain't my motherfucking play. It's Koi, it's Koi, and she's been wearing wigs. So I don't want nobody to think that I told Koi to wear no pink wig or I told Koi so to wait, wear wigs. So, so listen, I'm, I I love my Koi Ray braids, but as a female, like, come on, y'all not like ladies and gentlemen. Let's be real. I should be able to do switch up my hair. Like, I look good in there. You got to know I look good. So don't talk about why she wearing wigs. Let's talk about the fact that I look good in it because I love my <laughs> She's mad braids. Cocky. I signed the Coil Ray braid, but damn, can I try something else? I just want to see if it looks good, you know? So, ladies, Koi is still possibly looking for a girlfriend, possibly. Oh, my God. Not necessarily right now. She wants a boyfriend, but but Koi, the thing is, a lot of girls are attracted to you. I what know they you... love me. They love me. I love the energy. Like I could, I could, I still, it's still energy and still love. It's just, you know, it's not nothing sexual, you know. I don't want somebody to bend me over and break my shit. Like, yes. What? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I, I, I not jewel of that man, okay. <laughs> um well, I'm just saying, um, so shout out to all of her fans that are attracted to her. I think that's cool. No, I'm not. I ain't no talking about Nikki crushing. No, Nikki's not crushing on anything. Goodbyes. Have a seat for you. Get blunt. Um, um, no, I'm talking and speaking in, in the perspective of her fans. You guys. They love me. Ladies love uh. boy. Uh, girl, ain't nobody say all of that shit. Yeah, ladies love Koi. Um, we... <laughs> Yo, you're the best. You don't understand. Like, I want everybody to know who's listening here. Like, I swear to God, she's really the most dudes. Like, I don't even want to say, like, yo, you don't understand, Nikki. The fact that you're so genuine and you're a real person is so crazy because you're like a, you're a superstar. Like you're an icon, like you're a legend. And I don't think people understand. And I want you to know that like you are in to be this humble and this genuine to show me this much love. I appreciate this. I really, really do. And thank you so much. Cause you've like really changed my life. I ain't never had no number one in my life. And this is crazy. Like it's so, so many more to come. You're so freaking talented and versatile and, and you are who you are. Oh my God, I love that. I can't tell you how, uh, well, that's for another show, child. You are, you know who you are. And I love, I love, oh, bitch, listen, let me tell you something. I love our conversations behind the scene, bitch. But don't text me at four o'clock in the morning, child. Because what if Papa, what if you was woke, woke up Papa Bear last night? I said, bitch, I, I, I'm I sorry. I was hoping, I'm sorry, because I had just got home and I was just like, I don't even, I forgot what I even texted you. I'm sorry. I'm I still, I said, ooh, if you was I'm a, anxious. The what? song was dropping last night. I, you know, I needed to make sure. Like, I, I'm what? anxious, girl. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm what? Sorry. If you was a boy, you would have got your ass cussed. Yeah, because I cuss guys out all the time. Like, you know, I cussed this one boy out recently. He's an artist, but we ended up doing a song together. I did, he knew I, I didn't mean any harm. He was okay. But, um, but yeah, I said, why is she texting me at 4 o'clock in the morning? What? I said, oh, the Yo, listen, the song was dropping. The, the, the video was dropping. Like, I need, to, I need to speak to you one last time. Like, that breath of air like come on Nikki come on let me just hear you I need to I need you to sit me back real quick and you did you came through 
<laughs> yes, ma'am. Well, listen, you did your motherfucking thing. You did your motherfucking thing whenever Lick. you body it. You bodied it. You bodied that. And for the record, um, No More Parties is but still my favorite song from you. And when is your album coming out? My album's dropped in April 8th. April 8th? Yes, and it's going to be crazy. I'm telling you, like, I'm telling you, Nikki, it's over. You don't got to worry no more. Like, I got you. You see my picture? April you see my shit with the Glock? I got you. You don't got to worry. I got Why you. Why didn't put our dance? We're going like this. Blick, blick. The dance. See, I had it down pat. You got to come to the house so we could do our little TikTok. You should have canceled today, but I was tired. I thought I was going to go to sleep, but I then and then Fendi came over here, so I didn't go to sleep. But we got to do it. We got to do our little TikTok. And, I'm going to uh, do it. I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm, we're going to. I'm caught. Live. Come on. Call uh, me. I'm pulling up. Yeah. Fendi, open the door. Tomorrow, tomorrow or the following day, let's let's do that little cute part. But anyway, in the meantime, Barb's, I love you. I love you so fucking much. Trendsetters, you rock. Um, and we gon' and we gonna keep it popping. What but you know the come up DVD is back on the map. Me and Fendi is here. Um, Champagne Poppy, I know you probably already dropped off because that's how you be doing the girl, but listen, me love your long blood crack time, you know. You understand? All right, got all right, Koi. Take care. Hi, right, man. Knock us. <laughs> we out of here. <laughs> you see, she tried to um flaunt the sneakers in my face one time before she left, right? Again, she, uh, uh, that ain't right. Okay, y'all. Um, I will see you guys next time. And I saw you, um, Rico Diana. Um. All right, y'all. So don't forget, blick, blick. <laughs>